Hi, this is Rochelle with Scrap Craft Tastic, and today I'm going to be doing some planning in my social media planner, which happens to be a Dollar Tree planner. And I know several people were looking for these in Dollar Tree. Well, just today I was in Dollar Tree and I saw that they have out the 2020 versions. So they have them in this size, the B6 size, and in a smaller size similar to personal size. So if you were interested in finding these, now is the time to start looking. I'm also going to be using these stickers, Kiosha, from Coco's Vision for my spread. And I also pulled out this washi as options to use for this spread. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. Now I did miss a couple of weeks in this, so I'm just going to pick up where we are. I'm not going to do any back planning or anything like that. So we're going to be planning from Monday, July 22nd through Sunday, July 28th. So I was thinking that I could use, even though this washi is entirely too wide, that I could use it up top. So I want to get some use out of it. I don't use it that much. So... I'm thinking I'm going to need to cut it a little bit. So I'm going to do that. It's just a matter of where am I going to cut it and how am I going to cut it. I guess I need one of those old sticky pages. I'm going to make it a little too long. Let's see how much do I need to cut off. See, these are the things you all miss <laughs> whenever I do a time lapse because I just pretty much cut this part out. I think I can cut off about a quarter of an inch and go from there. So let's do that. And I might as well go ahead and do another piece for the other side. Yeah, I definitely need to start using this washi. It's already starting to go bad. I can feel the stickiness on the other, um, on the unrolled washi, which is not good. Okay. So let's ahead and do our headers and I'm just going to go ahead and cover the calendar part and I need my ruler so I'm just lining the ruler up with the edge of the lines and I'm probably not going to be able to tear that because I didn't leave enough excess on that side to get a good grip on it. So I'm going to be carefully using this X-Acto knife to trim that little bit off. This is that shiny slippery washi tape so it's hard to get a hold on it. And then I'm going to do the same on this side just lining the ruler up with the lines. There you go. So let's use this other piece. Uh, it's gonna make the hello show up on this side this time. So we got enough excess on this side so I can just use the ruler to cut it off. But on this side, we're back to the exacto. And maybe that didn't work. There we go. Now that's a little too close to July, so I'm going to cut some more off because that would 
worry me. So I'm just gonna trim a little hair more off. There we go. Okay. So we're off to a good start. Now, I think this is a little too busy next to the text. So I think I'm going to go in with the gold. I may just use this one. I think I'm just going to go in with this one. So I think I'm going to stop it short of covering the days. I'm not going to even do date cover-ups this time. I'm going to leave it as is. And so since Wednesday is the longest day as far as letters in the word, um, I'm going to stop it right outside of Wednesday. So I'm going to use that as my guide. So And then I probably will alternate, but then again, maybe I'll just use this for all the days. I don't know. I'm going to start out alternating and see how that looks. And then if I feel like I want more, then we'll do more. And what I could do is use the animal print use the animal print for the weekend maybe I think I can move this out of the way now so we can have some more room to work and I could use those extra pieces also hmm. so these are all the things that are usually going through my head when I am doing the planner spread <laughs> so I'm gonna go in I'm going to go ahead and use this stripe washi. Oh, that's too much. No, nope, we're not going to do that. Uh, what other washi do I have that could bring this together? I guess we'll do the gold. No, nope, let's lay down our doll. So I think I'm going to use her on the, on the weekend area because I don't do that much social media work are planning for weekends so that's where she's going to go let's get her in place and I'm gonna set her on the line make sure she's not hanging off the page she's gonna go on the line for Sunday adjust her feet a little bit there we go so I think that's pretty cute let's go in with some of this gold and it is a little too wide but we're gonna roll with it the way it is a little air bubble in it like that this is crooked <laughs> um, let's line this up and get rid of the excess so now I'm just going to go ahead and finish adding some of this gold washi I'm not going to worry about where she is right now I think I have a solution for that area so I'm just going to put another piece over here and it doesn't matter like I was saying that it's too wide we're just going to work with it the way it is just line everything up now I could make a fishtail on the end and I think I will so I'm just cut out a triangular area that will help disguise a little bit that the washi is too wide 
and hopefully that did not just go through the whole piece of paper. Just going to peel this up. So there we have our fishtail. Make sure that's laying down. There. I could go and do it on the other side, but I don't think that's necessary. At this point, let's not push our luck. Okay, so then I'm going to come down here by her and use this. And this tape, I don't think it sticks very well. Um, let's do this. And if I can lift her feet up, I probably can run that washi up under her. Mash it down good and use the rounded edge of this ruler to kind of burnish that down. Um, make sure that it adheres. And I think I can do that because I can use one of the colorful boxes or an empty box over it if I need to write anything down. So I'm going to err on the side of using the washi. Now I'm going to add some of this black washi down on the bottom lines to accent the day. Okay, and I'm going to use try to use this um, gold glitter washi. It doesn't actually stick very well on the roll. Hopefully, it will stick to the paper. Yeah, it doesn't feel like it's sticking to the paper either. Trying not to stretch the washi because that's what causes the paper to start curling. Which I think I probably did at the top a little bit too much already. Then I'm going to come in. I know I am so totally overdoing it with this spread, but why not? So I'm going to add some pink to offset the pink in the animal print. Of course, the only thing about the thin washi is it does not like to stick. There's just something about it. is crooked but I'm going to leave it alone and then I'm going to come across here since this is Monday oh, upside down and to a line across Monday how does that look no that's too much maybe do one under the banner since it's a little bit crooked, that'll help straighten it up. <laughs> so I said I was going to do this a while ago. And that is use some of these old Happy Planner stickers. These were like the original stickers Happy Planner came out with. I got them upside down. These were like, these were the original books. And let's see. They're from... 2014, 2014, 2014, 2016, 2016, 2015, 2015, 2014, 2015. So 2014 through 2016. And these are the original Happy Planner planner stickers. And I need to use these up. So I was thinking I would do a spread completely with these just these but for this one I'm gonna go ahead and use some of these they're much bigger you can't write on them um, but I think I can work them into this spread 
for example I can use this to do sticker and I can put it right up here and I think that would be cute and then I can do something as far as my list then I can use like the star I can use I can work with these so we're gonna work with the old vintage happy planner stickers on this spread I think I'm gonna go ahead and add another piece of washi there because that empty space looks weird and again if I need to write something there then I can just use a box And I probably will. Let's stick that back down. Okay, that doesn't want to stick, so I'm going to put a little dab of glue on there. To help it out. Okay. And then I'm going to place something on it to hold it in place because it seems to be popping up. Okay, so I put the to-do. I'm going to use these old stickers. I think that's where I left off. So I think I'm going to use this right off the bat going to use that right there and then I think I can tuck a box up under there let's get these already say to do on them but we can use some of these this and I'm going to use this make it work sticker again I'm placing them kind of strategically so that they do not take up a lot of space where I would actually be writing I think this is the most interference so um let's see do we want to say hello weekend let's do it I'm gonna put that right there may be able to just get away with just using this book let's see what else we have here uh, let's see if I can get this one to stick if it'll stick then I'll use that Put a little glue, help her out. And then, let's 
see what we got here. Let's just go in and put some glue on here because I can already tell it's not going to stick. I don't know what's going on that's making them not stick, but... I'm going to use the Paper Mate Flare. I hope I don't end up regretting this. Um, so I'm going to do my top three on Monday. And that is... going to do a little lettering and it does bleed through a little bit okay so I'm going to focus on Patreon I really need to get in the groove with that on what I want to do with it I'm going to focus on Journal Life's Journey Post. I have a new Instagram account just for journaling. And then I need to re focus on recording and editing because I have quite a few videos recorded that need to be edited and I have ideas of new videos to record. So. this away I do need a box which one of these books had the boxes in it it wasn't that one I think I think it was this can I use one of these ticket things seems to be sticking okay so this is for a plan with me. Hopefully I won't smear that. Let's get my stickers out. One day I'll get around to labeling this. Don't have to worry about ballet right now. I'm not gonna have any new releases. I think I am since this is the end of the month. So I'm just gonna put that on Friday and let's do my buffer on Monday. And I'm gonna do it on Thursday. really go over edit because I gotta edit 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 I'm about to record a bunch of videos today so I need to get busy editing well, let's do recording too so we emphasize those top three um, I'm going to put here next week. See if I can do it small. I think this pen is a little too thick. <laughs> and see what we can use out of here. Because I know I got my Instagram stickers from JD in Brooklyn. These will probably be the only colorful things in here. Let's see. I'm going to plan next week. Put face. 
Facebook. And I think that's the only ones that are in here. But I do have some new ones. I think I like it better right there. Okay. So my hand is cramping up again. Um, I think that's an it for this. And I can fill in the other things I need to do later. So, uh-oh. The washi tape is coming off. I might have to add some glue to the glitter washi. But I think that is it for this spread. I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> but it's functional and I can go back in and fill in what I need to fill in. If you like videos like this, please give the video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And also hit the little bell so that you'll receive notification each time I upload a new video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.